Hey all, it's Josh and Dan with Battle Bond here. Yeah, we're all together finally. <laughs> Never in reports together. Yeah, and uh, we're going to play some Middle Earth strategy battle game for you guys. Hey Dan, so why don't you tell us what you brought today? Okay, still trying to win on camera with elves. Uh, I got seven spearmen with uh, shield. I got three with just sword and shield. Gilgalad is being air restorer today. Um, and then I got one knight and a banner with a uh, shield and spear. And then I decided to bring Aragorn today, and he's got armor and, uh, geez, what's his sword name? The sword upgrade. Okay, and that's going to be 450, 450 points. Yeah, uh, exactly. Rivendell. Nice. Okay, and then for me, I'm back with Isengard again. So it's going to be the same list as last time. So we got Lurtz. We got five Urukai with Sword and Shield. And then we have 10 with Pikes back here. And then we have Vrasku. And we have six crossbows, three berserkers, and a banner. And yeah, so if you guys like the looks of these models, you can help support us and the channel by checking out our shop at etsy.com slash shop slash battlebond miniatures. And we have a discount code for you guys that will pop up on the bottom of the screen. So if you guys use that, you can get 10% uh, off your order. For the scenario today, we rolled up Destroy the Supplies. So we'll just kind of do an overview of the battlefield here for you guys. So you can see we got some woods and some ruins and some other stuff in the way. And then our armies here. So Isengard is over on this side, kind of defending two of the supplies. One of them is by that forest. And then Rivendell is over here, kind of centrally deployed. All right, so we'll do the priority roll, and then we will come back to you guys with the first round of the game. OK, priority roll. Four oh, for nice. good. Even of the road. One. One. All right, so you get first round priority. OK. Would you like to call anything, Dan? Uh, I don't think so. Not okay. first round. Me neither. So we'll come back after the end of the movement phase. So coming back to you guys at the end of the movement phase. So we'll start with Isengard here. Everyone kind of just moved up to hopefully do some body blocking later on and kind of come face the elves who are marching up this way with Aragorn. And then there's a knight trying to flank around over here. Yeah. So, uh, Priority time. Let's burn some supplies, hopefully. Yeah, we've got no shooting and no combats, obviously. Four again, so six. Over to me. All right. Um, I will not call anything. <sighs> me neither. Okay, so we'll come back to you guys at the end of the movement again. Okay, so coming back to you guys after the end of the movement phase. So all of the crossbowmen stood still. Um, this knight came around over here. Berserkers are trying to run up and help out. Everyone else kind of has a shield wall formed up here. And then the elves kind of moved up all as one unit. So going into the shooting phase, Vrasku can actually take a shot. So yeah. he's right here. This guy, I believe. Yeah, so yeah. he's going to shoot at that elf um, because there's nothing in the way there. So we got two shots. Please? Yeah. Okay. Both so hit. both hit. Death five on these, I believe. Okay, so I need fives. Yep. Yeah. Oh, got him. So got him. All right. This one, right? Yep. Nice. So first kill for Vrasku. So there's no combats, obviously. So Go priority time again. We got a six. Oh, that's I guess you. I just get it. Yeah, then. you just get it. I don't think that's good, though, necessarily, because I can't get into melee with you. Um. Oh, some of them could, but. Do you want to call anything, Dan? Mm, no. Me neither. So, yeah, we'll come back to you guys at the end of the movement phase for this next round. Okay, so end of the movement phase. Uh, again, none of the crossbow Urukai moved. This knight is peeking out over here to take a shot with his bow. These three kind of broke off from the main group to head towards the objectives over here. Berserkers are coming in. And then the big block of Urukai moved just outside of six inches of all of the elves. So we'll come back to you guys with some shooting. The Rivendell Knight there managed to pick off one of the Urukai. So we're just coming back to you guys with uh, these three. So Vrasku and two regular Urukai. 
Um, they're going to shoot into the knight over here. Baraski is going to be the blue dice. So whites are fours, blues are threes. So we hit with one of each, and then we got to do our in the way checks. So we get through with the regular one, <laughs> then and then do up or there. down. So it goes to the horse, and, and then, then I need a four to kill it, him. So. Four to kill the horse. No. Nope. <laughs> Good shooting. All right. We'll finish up our shooting, and then we'll that. come back to you guys at the, the end of the round. These three decide to go into just the front line of elves. Did absolutely nothing. No combats. So let's go on to priority. Nice. And a six. So uh, would you like to call I, anything? Yeah, I'm going to call a move with Oglen. Okay. Um, I will call nothing. So we'll come back to you, with, to you guys after we go through the movement. And in the movement phase, so all of the Rivendell plus Aragorn woodland creature ran into the woods over here. And then the Urukai kind of ran away and are coming up the flank over here. We sent some back to guard uh, this objective. And then once again, all the crossbows are standing still. <laughs> so uh, we'll do some shooting and we'll come back with that. Coming back to you guys with shooting. So we're going to do the same thing as last round. So Vraskou, these two, going to go into this knight. Yep. So if you get to shoot first this time. Yeah. So we'll see. Blue is going to be Vraskou again. So not in the tray. Okay. So we hit with three. That's nice. nice. Then I guess in the ways. Yeah. Let's see how that goes. So got two. Hey, same as last time, I think. Only this time I have a mite behind one. True, yeah. Uh, and then let's see up or down. So uh, one up, one down. Okay. Uh, <laughs> the down one has the mite, of course. Kay. So let's see if we kill the horse. We do not. Kay. Don't want a mite to kill the horse. Oh, that's a good. Uh, yeah, you know what? <laughs> we will mite that. <laughs> or can you wait to see if you kill the guy, maybe? Uh, no, we'll just do it right now. Okay. And then uh, we'll see on the, the rider. I think you kill him, right? Five. Yeah, so, so five will just, just kill him. both. Yeah. All right. Sounds good. And then, okay. uh, and then I got a dagger to throw from. Yeah, so, uh, yeah I'm just going to try to pop it through the loads. Yeah. And if I kill someone in the way, so be it. So I'm fours because I moved. Got it. Uh, so do those three in the way, I think. Yeah. First guy, oop, not in the dice tray. Goes through, goes through. Goes through. So yep. loads. Uh, defense, defense six. Strength three. Yep. Sixes. What? Sixes. Okay. Nope. Uh, you know what? I'm going to mite that up. Okay. Two is six. So he is down to one might. Uh, all right. Lords will fate that. He's one and only fate. Nice. Oh, God. Leader point. I guess we're just taking a wound. <laughs> okay. So no combats. Yeah. So we will do our priority roll. We got three again. Two. two over to you. You gonna call anything? Um. Yeah, you know what? I think I will call a move with Lurts. Okay, I will call one with Aragorn. Okay, it'll be a roll off. Yeah, and I do it because I have priority, right? Yep. So four is you. Okay. End of the movement phase here. So you can see we are pretty stuck in it as far as combats go. These guys are beelining it towards those objectives. Um, these guys moved over a little bit. The rest of the crossbows stood still. And then these guys just kind of formed up over this objective. So we have some shooting. So we'll actually just come back at the, the end of the shooting phase. And then we've got some combats now. We'll do the roll off, right? Do it yours. Yeah. Okay. okay, so end of the shooting. So we had uh, these three, Brascu. Into the elf that was here, you can see he's gone. So Vrasku didn't do it, but one of these nice guys did for me. And then over here, going into the combat phase, uh, Lurtz is calling a hero combat, and then so is Aragorn. So we'll do the roll off for that. So let's see. Uh, so it's going to go to good. Good. Okay. So we'll come back with that combat. It's going to be Aragorn versus these three uruk -hai. So... One with shield and two with bites. Yeah. So let's see. You get the six. It you doesn't got a matter. Five. Oh. All right. Let's see what I get. Uh, you got six. The six. Uh, I will, well, yeah, I guess I get a banner, banner first. Yeah. No, I will mite it up. Okay. So he is down to one mite. All right. Okay. And then wounding. Yep. Oh, sorry. These are yours. Uh, so, so I wound on fours. fours. Yeah. So Don't. you kill him. Aragorn moved into alerts here. So now we've got that combat to go. 
So we got uh, an elf and Aragorn. Yep. Okay, the, the elf will do a two-handed strike. Got the six. Okay. So that means I do it, right? Yep. Okay. So uh, what slice is defense? Six. Okay, so Aragorn's just fours, so he's dead. He has three wounds. Violets! And that's it. Okay, um, so we'll come back at the end of the combat phase. Combat phase, uh, the rest of them fared as well for the Urukai as Lurtz's fight. So basically, we lost all of them, yeah. and we lost, I think, three Urukai to combat. <laughs> yeah, elves cleaned up. Yeah, so but it's we, their time to shine. Yeah, we got these guys getting ready to burn our supplies, though. Yeah. So it's all that Lembus bread you're going to get rid of. Priority roll. All right, we got a six. All right, that's you. Oh, because you, right, I called a thing. Are you calling anything? Uh, no. Oh, it's just the, the only guy I have is Vrasky over yeah. here, so he's just going to hang out where he is. So okay. Over right. to you, and we'll come back at the end of the movement phase. Okay, so end of the movement phase. So we got a big cluster over here. These guys are still in it for the objectives. They're going to be able to get those two this round, and this guy's kind of headed over in that direction. Um, these guys kind of just walked up a bit to maybe slow some advances here. And then these guys all stood still. So going into the shooting phase, Vrasku is going to call a heroic accuracy. And we're going to do some shooting into Aragorn over here. So we'll come back once that's done and let you guys know how it goes. Shooting phase was quite good for me. So we managed to go through and only are using Vrasku's last point of might. We made it through all of the in the ways, and we got four hits on Aragorn, wounding three times. Yeah. And he used all three of his fate. Fate and a might. Yep. And uh, took one wound. Yeah, so he took one wound total. Um, so, yeah, these guys, they're just going to end up uh, blowing those up. Burning, so we'll, yeah. We won't worry about that. And then we'll come back with some combats over here. Do you want to call anything with Aragorn, Dan? Uh, I think I'm... Actually, no, I was going to do a heroic combat, but that'll be my... You know what? I will. I'm using my last might to do a heroic combat. Okay, so Aragorn just has his free might left, and then there's one might left on uh, yeah, Air, Store. Air Store over here. So, yeah, we'll come you know, back with uh, Aragorn's fight. It's just going to be Aragorn versus my banner. So, let's see how it goes. Got the six. Got the six, sure. Okay, do I get the four? Yep, it just needs a four. Got the four. Cool. So that's it for my banner. And then he gets to go into another combat. He's going to go around and go into these two. Okay. And then, uh, yeah, we'll come back with some more combats. Okay. So we're going to come back with Aragorn versus this one pike. Okay. He's got three shots. Oh, only three high. And he did that a little earlier. Yeah. We'll see against Lurch. Oh. Uh, all right. Looking for fours. Yep. Uh, didn't it. get it. No, it didn't. Oh, yeah, I forgot, are, I forgot yeah. your faces are ones. The faces are ones, yeah. Okay. And All then right. we're yeah. going to do Aristor versus the yep. one pike over here. Okay. Got the six. Yep. And uh, these will be strength Fives. four or five. Okay. Got it. Got them. All right. So we'll finish up the combats, and we'll come back at the end of the phase. Okay, so end of the combat phase, and <laughs> went about as well as expected. Urukai did nothing, just lost guys. Uh, but that's okay. They are meat shields. So let's go to priority, priority roll. Got a six. Yeah, I had it so, last time though. Yeah. So. so if I get a six, I can get it. Nope, yep. it's good. Okay. I have no might, so I can't call anything. I will also not call anything. Okay, so we'll come back after the movement phase. End of the movement phase. Everyone moved this round, so all the crossbows moved from where they were. We're going to try and get stuck in combat here. Got some elves run down over here bravely. We'll yep. see how that goes. Got to burn some supplies. Yep. Bunch of warriors stuck over here. Aragorn's over there. And then we have some a couple of guys coming over to try and stop these guys from getting to that. From burning, yeah. Objective. So no shooting. So we will just come back with some combats. Okay, so the Urukai numbers are dwindling here. We're at the last combat of the round, which is Aragorn versus two pikes. Let's see if we can do it. Oh, five high. Yep. Oh, we got, got the six. The six. So I'll do my banner reroll first. No, and I'll might that up to a six with my free one. Sure. I need fours to wound. Yep. No. 
Right. They're going fails. <laughs> okay, they <laughs> lived apparently. Yeah, they lived to fight another day. All right, and then and uh, priority. Yeah, priority for next round. Okay. Two. Two. Oh. All right, come on. All Five. right, it's over to evil. Okay, it was still is going to call a heroic move with his last might. Sure. And I have no might, so I'm not calling anything. So we'll come back at the end of the movement phase. Yeah. We are back at the end of the movement phase. So the Uruks ran up a bunch, tied up models, and came over here. Hopefully we'll win some combats. And um, there's no shooting because all of the crossbows moved. So we're just going to go into combats. Yep. And then I'm going to call Heroic with Aragorn's free might. Right. So we're going to start over here. Aragorn versus one Uruk. Four. And then two. Okay. So I need you. fours to wound. Got it. Cool. And then we are going to go into Vasco. Okay. So okay. we'll come back with some more combats. We're coming to the last combat of the combat phase, which is going to be Aragorn versus Vasco. Um, the Urukai managed to kill enough elves to break them. So that was good, at least. Uh, so let's see how this combat fares. Five high. All right. And, and no Rasku might for me. Two attacks. I also don't have any might. Oh, Plus you got six, it. So I win. Yeah. And you're what? De defense, defense five. Six? Five for him. Okay, so I'm wounding you on fours. Okay. So we got one. So we got one. one. So he's and down to one wound remaining. Yep. Ooh, I'm getting close to a leader kill here, even. Yeah. That's scary. All right. Okay, so we're going to do priority for next round. Three. All right. Two. Two. It's good. Okay. Are you going to call anything, Dan, with your free might? No. And I have no might, so I won't either. So we'll come back after movement. We went through the movement and shooting phase. Um, so just as a quick recap, this guy didn't move, so he shot down here and did absolutely nothing. Yeah. And then as far as movement goes, we have a just a big just cluster of... <laughs> the last... Last surviving elves which are trying to survive. Yeah, that's right. And then yeah. over here, trying to hold me back from getting to um, the last that point. Objective. Yeah. So, yeah, we'll come back with some hero combats. We're going to start with Aragorn versus these two and Varasku. Okay. Oh. So he's a three high. Three high. My remember, dice have betrayed me at the end. Remember, these dice, the picture is a one. Oh, yes. Uh, all right, so I got okay. a four. So I'm going to do my banner reroll. Got the five. Okay. Okay, I'll put these in. How many wounds does Vasco have left? Two. Two? Okay, I'll put all three in the Vasco. Sure. Got him. Okay. Unless you have a fate. Uh, he he does probably actually, has a fate, yeah. right? Yeah, he does still have his fate. Yeah, he so, hasn't taken anything. Let's roll the one fate. Got it. Passes, so he's actually still alive. Yeah. All right. One wound remaining. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so the Urkai okay. came back hard. Yeah, so we're at the end of the combat phase here, and you guys can see there. Mm. there's a lot of missing elves. Yeah, I think so, four or five died. Yeah, the Urukai won and killed a lot of them. And it was enough to bring them down to 25%. So we're going to actually roll to see if the game continues. Okay, I think it's one or two, it said. Yeah. There it ends. All right. Okay, so you... That, that's it for the game, so we'll come back with a recap and uh, the points, and then we can just talk about how stuff went. Going over things at the end of the game. So we checked the numbers, and uh, Isengard actually is not broken. I know. So One uh, more model. Yeah, so it was one, one model off. So it'll be uh, four for the... Um, Two supplies. Yeah, the supplies that um, got destroyed. It'll be one for doing a wound or multiple wounds to Aragorn, but not killing him. Yeah. Um, and then it is two for breaking and not being broken. So it's seven for Isengard. And uh, just two for me for killing his leader. I didn't burn any uh, supplies. So the Lembus bird that was going to those poor elven children will never make it there. <laughs> yeah, so, um, I mean, it, it basically looks like this last round of combat pretty much swung things yeah. in Isengard's favor quite a bit. Um, it was really close up until then. Yeah, yeah, I think it was one of the game. Um, I think I still need to work on my positioning. Because there were a couple times like where you got a shot where I could have not been in line of sight, but I right. forgot to check. Yeah. Um. So I think that 
it kind of snowballs sometimes if I make those little mistakes because elf guys are so expensive. Yeah, and honestly, I think running your cavalry out by himself was probably a big mistake. Like you should have just kept him. Yeah, with, with your other models. I should have. I was you, thinking you been like fighting together with them. Yeah, I was thinking I needed something to get that, but I should have just focused on getting one supply down. Yeah, and stopping you. I also think I should have sent guys back like you did right at the a beginning. Sooner, yeah. Like maybe Aristotle should have just went back right away. Yeah, and then he could have just stood in the way and food daggers and stuff and use the forest to avoid getting shot at. Yeah, um, but it's a live and learn thing. <laughs> yep. Um, I'm pretty happy with Aragorn. He always performs for me. Um, but I think it's, he's pretty expensive for this point. Like he's half my points. By yeah. Himself. For, for 450 yeah. point game. Yeah. But he beheaded Lurch like the movie. So <laughs> I consider that a win in my book. <laughs> that's right. That's all you can ask for <laughs> yeah. at the end of the day. And right. your, your Bazooka got to kill one of them, I think. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. other than that, it's like you're shooting just like. Yeah. My, my shooting actually dominated this yeah. game quite a bit. Yeah. Um, Till that last round of combat, I think you had five kills plus two wounds on Aragorn from shooting. Yeah. You're right. Yeah. So. In eyes and gut shooting, it's yeah. pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, it was good. Uh, overall, fun game. Yeah, and yeah. yeah, if you guys like what you're watching, make sure to give the video a like and give us a subscribe. And we'll be back again with some more Middle Earth strategy battle game videos. Bye.